Thanks. Well, here at 23 ABC, we are proud to promote the importance of literacy. With today being National Reading Day, it was only fitting to do our big giveaway at Zephyr Lane Elementary as part of our annual If You Give a Child a Book campaign. 23 ABC's Emma Lockhart joins us in studio with more on how children went home with a new book and a special message. Emma? Jess, this morning was full of surprises. Not only did hundreds of local students go home with a book, but our parent company, the Scripps Howard Foundation, presented the Kern Literacy Council with $10,000. The giveaway shining a light on the importance of literacy with us here at 23 ABC News, hoping our gift instills a passion for reading at a young age and the resources to succeed. There was gratitude, a room full of joy, and a little Star Wars action at Zephyr Lane Elementary Thursday morning. 23 ABC News sent hundreds of students home with their very own book, a simple gift, but one that can make all the difference in a child's life. The number of books in the home is a key indicator of school success. Our partner, the Kern Literacy Council, says many children attending low-income schools here in Kern County don't have a single book at home. Our giveaway this morning, all in an effort to change that. A few months back, 23 ABC employees donated thousands of dollars from our paychecks as part of our company's If You Give a Child a Book campaign. The mission of the campaign to fill local children's hands with books that will help them blossom academically. So when you build that love and that foundation of reading skills at such a young age, I feel like it carries positively through. We also gave thousands to the KLC to support programs year round. The most impactful surprise of the day, presenting the KLC with a $10,000 check from the Scripps Howard Foundation. Oh my God. The KLC now armed with funding to help underprivileged children thrive and Zephyr Lane students now with a book of their own that can open a world of opportunity. She was outside taking some pictures with the kids in their books and one said, I'm going to read it. I'm going to have my parents read it to me. And one kid said, I'm going to read it myself. So they really are enthusiastic. Now, the KLC says they will use the money donated today to help combat summer reading loss, an issue they say impacts underprivileged children who can fall behind two or three months every summer. Reporting in studio, Emma Lockhart, 23 ABC, connecting you. So cool. Thank you.